What's up everybody, Poke Chaos here, back for some more Pokemon TCG Online, and today we are in the expanded format rather than the theme deck format because we are going to be using the Keldeo EX deck from the Keldeo vs. Rayquaza Battle Arena decks. Now, I could show off the entirety of this deck list in a nice little format, but I don't really feel like it. Uh, we'll go over the basic like the the most obviously good cards in the deck if you guys enjoy the video if you're excited for those battle arena decks to finally happen make sure to hit the like button make sure to subscribe and first up we have Blastoise of course with the deluge ability that will allow us to uh, attach as many water energies as we can in a turn we have Octillery that lets us draw up until uh, well, lets us draw until we have five cards in our hand once per turn. Uh, Articuno, which we did see in the Articuno theme deck, that allows us to take more than well, it allows us to take an extra prize. If we knock out an EX, that means we get three prizes. Uh, and the main addition to the deck, Keldeo EX, being useful for two reasons: one, its ability rush in, which allows us to play it into the active without having to retreat our active Pokemon and then Secret Sword does 50 plus 20 more for each water energy attached. Uh, Milotic. And when you play this from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon you may put a card from your discard pile into your hand. Not bad. Ah! Red Ice, uh, Resistance Blizzard does 70 and prevents all attacks all effects of attacks, including damage done to this Pokemon by EXs. Uh, we have Rare Candy to get our Blastoise out quicker. Again, does have VS Seeker. Uh, you got your standard trainers here. Of course, everything we saw in the opening of the deck, including Karen and uh, the promo Black and White 100N. And we have our energies. And we're just going to get into it. We're going to out of this we're gonna get into a match I do like Keldeo I'm one of the few people that actually likes Keldeo as the Pokemon and not just like the card uh, I like Keldeo I like the card I like the Pokemon and we are going up against a fire deck I wouldn't be surprised if this guy oh, I didn't want to pick tails see I always pick heads and I accidentally clicked on tails and of course, because I accidentally clicked on Tails, I got heads. So, I would love a Squirtle. Uh, what does Bianca do? Draw cards until you have six in your hand. Okay, that, that's good. That's helpful. Uh, I decided to use Articuno first, because again, it could get me extra prizes. And because he's using a fire deck, I have weakness in my favor. I don't know what he's using, but we'll figure it out. Uh, he's got Moltres and Volcanion. And Fennekin. Okay, this... What are you... I'm gonna play Bianca just to use the supporter card and then get Squirtle because oh well, I had it right so we're gonna hit chilling sigh put Moltres to sleep uh, he's gonna wake up anyway so that was stupid I bet he what what's he gonna do 20 damage to me big deal if I can get another water energy in my hand, I'm good. All I need is another water energy or a way to draw energy, which I didn't get. So, we'll put you back to sleep again, even if you do wake up, which you didn't, you'd only been able to do 20 again. Uh, well, I mean, this is expanded. 
You could have ways of getting Blacksmith out or using a double colorless energy. Why? I have escape rope. Do you think I care? Yes, you can use power heater. I guess. Or not. Water energy. Escape rope. I don't think you'll go out to Moltres, but if you do, then cool, and if not, I'm going to Lysander you, because I want Moltres dead, because it's the only one fucking energy on I didn't mean to curse there, but did it not kill? Okay, it killed. We have two prizes. We get his only Pokemon with energy off the field, and unfortunately I need more than one head to actually do anything. I don't care about a bursting balloon. You don't have energy attached to your Volcanion! I mean, I guess you're gonna probably like teammates for Rare Candy and Del Fox or something. I don't know. I would love it if I could get the VS Seeker to draw to get Lysander back and then Lysander out as Del Fox and kill it. But I was asking for a bit much, I think. Come on, yes! Volcanion is gone. Sure, I take 60 damage, but that's still, you know, the majority of my prizes being taken. Sure, you can use Psy Storm. Doesn't, like, hurt me, really. I mean, that actually probably will help me more than it helps him, so... Yeah, it helped me more than it helped him, so whatever. I got my Articuno, I don't care. Good for you! Play. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna play the energy. We're gonna deluge. Play the other energy. Play red dice. End my turn. I mean, by playing all my, by playing my energies, I power up Delphox. But it doesn't matter. All I have to do is get one more energy, and Keldeo destroys everything he has. I just need that one energy. And my deck doesn't have Shaman EX because I am actually using a pre-constructed deck, so I, in reality, have a disadvantage. I don't have, like, Shaman to rely on. I don't have... I mean, I have to top deck something good no matter what, which is the thing that sucks. So I have to top deck something necessary. Turns aren't really useful in this point though, is it? Like, no. I have to like get a sycamore. Or just something that will allow me to draw multiple cards. It doesn't matter if you have Delphox Break. I'm still going to destroy it in one hit. All I need is an energy. I don't know what Flare Witch does. Once during your turn... Uh, well, you may search your deck for Fire Energy and attach it to one of your Pokemon. I don't care. 
At this point, should I play? Should I just, I'd say I don't want to put Keldeo right out because there we go. Energy. Energy. Deluge. Energy. Rush in. Secret Sword. Dead Delphox. Now, you can do a hundred to me, which of course isn't enough. Well, I'm sorry, you can do 110. I did, unless you've been holding on to Volcanion EXs, I don't think you're going to be doing a whole lot. Like, you would literally have to play at least two Volcanion EXs right now. I swear. Like, this deck isn't a standard Volcanion EX deck anyways. I mean, if it was standard, it would be in standard, I guess, wouldn't it? I'm going to play Bridget. For whatever reason. Um, okay. Yeah. I don't I don't know what you're attempting to accomplish with this deck. In reality. I, I just don't. And you can see. So we got a victory there. Uh, for some reason they don't show you what you get in the mystery box right away. You have to like go to your collection and then it'll show you. And I don't feel like doing that right now. So we're just going to look for another match. And we'll do we'll do this one more match. I think I pretty much showed off what the deck is meant to do in that last match. Although I did have to sacrifice Pokemon constantly in order to do it. Um, here we're going up against the Fairy deck. Again, I don't think, like, well, I know that the Battle Arena decks are not necessarily meant to be, like, to go out and buy something semi-competitive. It's more of a, hey, this is a good way of getting some harder to obtain, some rarer cards, some more valuable cards. You know, you get VS Seeker, which... Is just an uncommon from Phantom Forces, but it's a very valuable card. Here's two of them for 30 bucks, and you know, Keldeo EX, which is a very good card in Expanded. Rayquaza, not so much, but still, you get four EXs, you get good uh, trainers, you know, you get some supporters, you get. Uh, you get some good stuff. Why am I going up against, like, crap in Expanded right now, though? Like, Togekiss EX should never be used. Are you going to use Zen right here? Aside from the fact that I have Milotic and Rough Seas in my hand, I would not be mad. I would not be mad if you used, uh, if you used N. I mean, because Milotic, I, ha I don't have anything in the discard pile, so okay, you're going to use Pokemon Bank Club. I, I just, I mean, I can understand if you're trying to use like the regular Togekiss, you're not. You have Xerneas and Florges EX, which again, Florges EX, not a good card. But again, I don't know what you're trying to attempt. Go ahead and play the water energy. We're going to go ahead and play rough seas. We're going to go ahead and dive ball for... Do I get Squirtle? Do I get Remoraid, maybe? Do we get Squirtle? We're just going to end the turn. I, I'm assuming he's going to want to use N right here. I'm assuming. Uh, and if he does, that means six cards for me. Possible Rare Candy and Blastoise combination. 
which again would be... Well, I got the rare candy and I got the Ultra Ball, so yeah. He's gonna go out to Xerneas and start Geomancing. I don't know why you played the Muscle Band on Xerneas. Unless you have Xerneas Break? It seems kinda stupid. Okay, so... We're gonna go ahead... Oh, I can just... Yeah, I can just play Milotic. Hit the Dive Ball. Dive Ball for Blastoise. Rare Candy. Play the Energy. Deluge. Play the other other energy. Uh, and Resistance Blizzard for 70. And then he's gonna heal, which I mean is annoying, sure. We'll see. Depends on if he decides if he like has Xerneas break. So far, no Xerneas break. So far we're okay. Um, I don't have anything in my discard right now. Let's let's go ahead and Ultra Ball for. Uh, do I want Keldeo? Yeah, let's get Keldeo. We'll just Resistance Blizzard again. Uh, Xerneas... As stupid as it is to have a Muscle Band on a Xerneas, it does allow him to knock out my Reg Ice with a Rainbow Spear. Which is unfortunate. Couldn't you have used N? I'll just say you don't have any fairy energies in your hand. Ah, you suck. That is so stupid. I need, like, Sycamore. Like, see, he's gonna win because he because I have bad luck with this deck right now. Not because his deck's better than mine. His deck sucks. He has Aromatis. Aromatis is freaking like obsolete at this point. And you're gonna use Aromatis? Are you kidding me? What does this do? 20 damage times and it's 130. 130? Oh, yeah, okay. I, I get it. Never mind. So we're gonna play Squirtle. Um, we're gonna play Archies. We can get Red Ice back out. And it'll allow me to draw five cards. I can then Deluge Energy here. Uh, use Russian. And Secret Sword for 110. And another Secret Sword will, of course, take Forges out. He will be able to do 130 to me again, but shouldn't be much of a problem. I can heal 30 of that off, and... He's, he's getting one card. I would assume that's something that you would want to actually... Okay, so you're gonna... You're gonna max... Oh my god, really? See... This just like stalls the game. That's not, like, you're not doing some super secret 
ultra tactic or something. You're stalling. We'll go ahead and ultra ball. We're gonna get War Portal and Professor Birch's observations for Remoraid. I don't know. We're gonna stick a more. And I'm honestly, at this point, just going to like. Okay. So, I was 110, 130, 50, 70, 90. It's not enough, right? It's not enough. Which is. A, no, I don't want to. No. Ah! Jeez. Okay. I don't want to attack. I want to deluge the energies under Reg Ice. Because if I do that, I have. Yeah, that, that 130, 50, 70, 90 wouldn't have been enough. Of course you have Fairy Drop. Like, who uses Fairy Drop and Max Potion with Aromatease? Like, that just seems dumb. We're going to put an energy on Keldeo. We're going to play Lapras. Professor Sycamore. We're gonna deluge. We're gonna play Octillery. We're going to Resistance Blizzard. Although I'm sure he'll just fairy transfer energies over to Azernius and do damage that way. Right? All he has to do is fairy transfer, retreat, fairy transfer. Yep. Which is annoying because it takes forever to do. It's just like. I just, I hate sitting here watching the animation for the stupid crap. So I'm gonna get my energies. I really only need one at this point. We're in a secret sword. Xerneas is gonna die. I get my first prize card. First frickin' prize card of the frickin' match. You can play this one. He's going to somehow manage to get enough energies. All he has to do, yeah. Fairy Garden. I mean, it doesn't matter at this point. You're just going to put it on that one anyway. So. Okay, let's deluge. Make sure I have some energy. Okay, well, let's just press done. Can I Skyla for... Nope. Okay. So, 110, 30, 50. I need to deluge at least one more. Just so I can have this one... Yeah, well, two more prizes. Not that it matters, because I lose anyways. But that's the problem with having a pre-constructed deck. You know. Why'd you go out to Snubble? Why? That doesn't even make sense. I mean, granted, you don't have energies, but... You can't just let me build up like this.
You can't just let me take the game! You are so dumb! Okay, well, if you guys enjoyed the video, do make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time with the Rayquaza EX Battle Arena deck. Until then, bye!